Hello guys, Luke Archer here, and today is Friday, and today we have the Friday video. And today uh, we're at the caravan show, so as always, I'll, let's get started with the day. Welcome to the caravan show. <coughs> NFC Birmingham. I'll, I'll talk to you guys later on. This is the caravan show. Yeah, this is this half. <laughs> We're now in the caravan show, caravan and motorhome show as they call it here. It's not the caravan show, it's the motorhome and, and caravan and camping show. Never been to this one before, but um, it's really cool. We're in the bathing section and there's quite a bit. I'm going to show you a bit more in a moment, but overall, not bad at all. My favourite camera, cam, caravan company, Luna. Phoebe, would you like to be in today's video? Yeah. What do you think of Luna's? They're amazing. And you could win this one. <laughs> With butterflies on it. I would love to win a butterfly caravan. Yeah, don't tell mum and dad about this one. This is a surprise. Okay, yeah, let's have a look in this one. Yeah. Okay, so here we are. Here's the mirror. Yay. Now this is the toilet. I'm not going to touch that. Just in case the it, it just in case the power is too in it shots to light. Hmm. I think that's the motion detector. Mm -hmm. TV stand behind your head. Oh, double shower. That's actually quite a rare option. That's a weird thing. Oh, don't rock about too much. You don't think the um, legs are down that much? It's got a good opening pattern. I didn't know about the cornered bed. That's quite a Bit weird. Anyway, this is the first proper video, and also you see Phoebe, and it's been a long time since you've seen her. That's cool. The cool feature we just found on this camera. Watch this. The picture lights up. That's amazing. And the rest of it's really cool. This is a Swift. Loads of caravans. Loads and loads. Look at that massive dog. It's the size of a damn camper van. Okay. Right. Here we go, guys. This is uh, basically the caravan show. I've got some footage. I don't know exactly what I've got, but I've got a lot from around the uh, Luna caravans. But uh, hopefully this is where we are. I don't know how it looks like in an aesthetic caravan, but here we go. There we go. This is the master bedroom that I would like. This is literally like a home. It's not like the caravans I have. So this one's a bit random as this door shares the the, um, the whole bathroom. This one will have two, or one even has a bath, but this has a shower. One bedroom, small basic, it's like those rental ones you go out, go on this, so this is a little bit more nicer, nicer to put so. yeah. I think so, the events are really big, so bear in mind that it's not that unusual for these to come around. It happens at least every year. I think there's two of them meant to happen this year. Um, but one for the, just the caravans and, and motorhomes, but this is camping every, every, well it's just the caravans, but this is all motorhomes and caravans squished together. But it's still in the same centre as the other one that happens. But uh, yeah, this is pretty cool though. Uh, but either way, I'm going to stop recording because this is probably copyrighted, but this is playing in a public place, so you can't blame me this time. Well, the uh, place is open for another hour, but we've decided it's, it's now it's heading up to five o'clock so we decided we're gonna head home especially for the midnight traffic so we're gonna head home but anyway really good day but uh, can i just start with just for a minivan they're 39 grand i, I feel like i'm like you're throwing off your money away i could buy the van cheaper and then can put the wind stuff in for way cheaper than that maybe with the hood up roof there yeah, maybe perhaps not but Um, 
Uh, and we're now back home where we have been just a while ago. I've just been on the Xbox again, enjoying myself on GTA again, just getting used to it. It's a bit of a ramble currently to me, but hopefully I think it should be good the more I get into it and stuff. But um, for now, it's not that bad. Um, I'll save it mostly what I didn't get on footage. Um, I've got quite a bit from the show, or the most of it will be entered in this. It's mostly around the Lunars. But this time, though, um, I sadly, I don't have the photo to show it. Um, but uh, we actually, well, it looks like we might be getting a new one, if maybe not new, but used. But I think I want a new one, if anything, because I don't like to know what people have been doing in their own vans. It could be quite disgusting, so, you know. I'd rather have a new one because it's clean, it has, you know, it hasn't had anything wrong. People haven't done anything wrong in it, or... You know, it's just that little bit more safety, and especially when you're sleeping in it and everything else. I, I prefer when it's a car and it's, you know, yours and it hasn't had anything weird done in it. Um, but yeah, as um, we, as um, sadly don't have a photo to prove, but um, if you, if the massive storm that's hit the entire of the UK, my caravan is stored at my nan's house and their tiles came off the roof and have left bullet like bullet holes in the side of the van so um yeah that's not looking good and it's and because of the age of it it's not looking that good and repairable so i'd like it is repairable but you know for the insurance side of thing though is it worth it and are they just gonna write it off or not because it's sort of roughly the same as car because it's got to be road worthy trailer when it comes out and nothing else so um yeah, that's on. Don't we? I'm, I'm perfectly fine. I know my eyes are quite red. That's just because it's two in the morning. Now I should be really be in bed. And as soon as I finish this, I can have a, a glass of milk and such. That will be it for me. Um, but yeah, guys. Um, either way, I hope you at least enjoyed this video. It was definitely more in, more interesting than what it normally would be. But um, one thing I just want to bring out though. Travel Lodge, I gotta say, I wouldn't really want to stay there longer than a night because well, I thought, like, um, a primary and you get 30 minutes um, of free Wi Fi, but in primary in it's per day here is 30 minutes when you first come in, and that's it, you're gonna have to pay for forever. Use that 24 hours, you gotta be there all that time to use that 24 hours, it's not, you can't just turn it off and turn it back on again. It makes you don't want really to use it. But it's really annoying. You know. mm. I wouldn't recommend it though going there if you want to use the internet. Um, I'd probably look at somewhere else. Especially if the price is like 24 hours, 3 quid, and you can't even, you know, when you leave, that tw that's internet time but is still being counted down when you're not using it. So I think they're really taking the piss. Travel one. Well, I do often like to say taking the piss that much in videos and such, but I I gotta say for obviousness they are literally are. There's no other way of saying about it. Um, but yeah, overall though, I tell it wasn't that bad. But the main thing of it all though, the trip, um, the caravan and motorhome show, a definite, a def, a definite thumbs up. Either way, guys, thank you so much for watching. Don't forget to comment, like, and subscribe. And I hope to see you in my next video. Bye.